Hi, I'm Rebecca from Mom Saving Money, and this is a video on MSM basic coupon binders. First, we have a one inch coupon binder that you can find at Walmart right now for 92 cents. And if you are new to coupons, I recommend doing starting out with a one inch. Um, as you get um, used to more of what coupons you use, you'll understand what size of the coupon binder that you'll need to help you out to save money. So, look out inside. MSN starter coupon binder will include a pencil pouch with scissors, pins, staples, and a stapler, which is not in here right now, and a notebook that can also be found at Kroger right now for 15 cents. If you're anything like me, I always make lists of every store I go to and which transactions I have, what coupons I'm going to use. I like to know what amount I expect to pay and what register rewards, if any, that I will get when I go to Walgreens or Catalina's if I go to Kroger. And this helps me stay on budget. I spend less than $50 a week on my groceries. That includes papers. Um, that includes any paper goods, any school supplies currently, or any razors, diapers, pull-ups. Then, MSM started coupon binder will include three sheet protectors. And these are for your red palm, your smart source, and your PNG inserts. Uh, this will help you in case you don't get a chance to Cut them right away, and then you'll have them in your binder, so when you go to the store, you can easily find them and know which ones you need. Then, there's five dividers, and they are divided in five main categories. Produce, frozen, dairy, meats, and canned goods. Then you'll find one in each section of the nine top load sleeves. And these can be found at Walmart, Target, Kmart. I get mine at Walmart now. They are in my area, three ninety eight for thirty five, which is an incredibly good deal. You'll want to notice that these coupons don't fit in completely, so they are folded. You want to make sure that when you fold them, that you don't fold on the barcode. As you see, these three are great to go, but this one up here, if you can see it, is folded on the barcode, and that one may not be able to be used. What happens is the register will beep because it can't read it correctly, which means they won't be reimbursed for that coupon. So please don't do this. Don't fold on the barcode. And that is pretty much it for the MSN Star Coupon Binders, but I am debating on whether selling these through my site, and if I do, I will also include the MSN Coupon 101 guide that includes how to organize your coupons by the binder method. It also has three other methods that you can organize your coupons by. It also includes how to find or how to recognize a fraudulent coupon where to find coupons, um, suggested other sites that can help you. Um, it also includes coupon lingo, and it's an easy, great resource to go back on. I always have to go back and check. It also includes a price list so you can keep track of the items you purchase, the regular price, the sale price, so that way you can make up your own list price of the items for your area. Every region is different, and this really, it helps me realize what items I purchase generally and what the lowest price I can get them at and what is stock up. And I hope you enjoyed this. Thanks for visiting Mom Saving Money.